This is going to be another long travel video and while the title says apartment hunting in Houston, it still is but I added a lot of experiences and moments that we can already call memories. But don't worry about this because now you can use the time coded timeline to figure out where the main things are in this video. So enjoy. It's kind of typical, when we go to travel, a huge part of our experience is the food hunt. So, we met my friend and we just ate for three days. Hi! <laughs> the end of another beautiful single life but I was almost hired to do pictures and videography in Houston just while I was videographing that video crazy as mentioned earlier we are happy when we can just try out new styles of food so we went out again but now on a birthday party it's Gary Getting ready? Yes. <laughs> we are here with this group, and of course, we are having some of this. I guess the thing about Texas is to eat, 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 right? <laughs> so now we are at a food truck, same day. And we were eating tacos. And we didn't even go to the bar. We're eating tacos. <laughs> and now that we have the food, we came into a really friendly bar. We got home pretty late, but our Texas expedition was not over yet. This is 1 a.m. and we are going because I did laundry earlier today and I lost two socks. So we're gonna see if if you can suck track, if we can find it. our socks. Yep. 
And it's not here. And it's not here. It's not. And I think this is a good example and a proof that dryers and washing machines are eating our socks. Right? Okay. Um, wait. Let's see that video again. I guess I was one beer too drunk to, to realize that my socks were actually were actually there. And yes, the next day on a Monday, we finally got to the point when we just visited the waterfall wall and then we went to see the apartments in Texas. So that's how our morning started. But now that we are in Texas and in Houston, we're gonna look for some apartments and uh, I will show you what, what type of a, an apartment you can get for, for about $1,400. Am I right? Yes. 14. Oh, 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 three life. So we're looking for three bedroom apartment, around 1,400 in a good neighborhood. And this is what you get for that price. First we went to the Creole Apartments on the Yorktown Road, which is a quiet, really nice neighborhood. And as soon as we stepped in and we saw these palm trees and trees and all the vegetation, <laughs> we knew that this would be a place where we would like to live. All the outside area around the pool is like a mini jungle inside, inside in the concrete jungle and it was just amazing, it was such a great feeling. In the heart of the apartment complex there are multiple offices and places that you can actually rent. Of course there is a gym which is quite small but as soon as we started to walk towards the apartment I was getting kinda concerned because as the lady who was taking us around was, was proudly saying this is an old apartment complex and yes, you can see, the rooms are a bit mm, darker, you can see carpet everywhere, the kitchen was like small, restroom, this is the guest restroom, guest room. We go over to the master restroom and there's one small sink for, <laughs> like that's just funny, and look at this, like, poof, that's a bit horroristic, but everything is like, oh. <laughs> And this apartment was about $1,600 and it's just such a bummer because we would like to live somewhere when we can connect, we can be closer to nature, but because of these apartments, this place will not be that place. All right, apartment number two. The second apartment was the Yorktown Apartments from the Yorktown Road. And this is somewhat a step up and somewhat a step down from the previous apartment complex. There are trees, all of these apartments will come with, with pools and little getaway areas where you can feel like you're part of the community. But there wasn't anything special that I can say that, okay, I want to live there because I want that. Um, if I'm looking at the paperwork, these apartments just look okay pool three bedroom nice area quiet all this for fifteen hundred dollar you walk in it's a lot better than the previous apartment this is the living room and from there you're stepping into the dining room of course the dining room is connected to the kitchen which is a step better than the previous one but it always bugs me when there's no window in the kitchen but this issue can be compensated with these fairly big rooms and and the look you can look out at the pool 
and a special point because you can look out at the pool while you're pooping. <laughs> Now the third one that we were looking at was the 28th district on the old Spanish trail. And before I would talk about the actual apartment, let me let me tell you what are the extra things that you can actually use. There are multiple areas that you can just rent, office. There are two gorgeous community rooms. If you think you gain a lot of weight during pandemic, there's a pretty nice gym. And as I said previously, all three of these apartment complexes are coming with pools. But let's talk about the apartment. We are stepping into a two bedroom apartment that you can rent for about $1500. And this is exactly what we need. Look at that kitchen. This is a selling point and it comes with a wine fridge. What? The, the rooms are just perfect. A lot of light comes in. It's minimalistic, modern and it's exactly what we need. But again, but again there's a bummer. Because if this apartment was located on the Yorktown Road where we started this whole tour, I would just say, okay, we move now. But uh, this apartment is just on a road next to the highway and I just don't want to live there. And after the apartments, well, you guys already know, after the apartments, we got so hungry that we had to go to the Asian district to, to try out some Hi. We got to the Asian district to try out some cool stuff. Welcome to the vlog. Hello. We are in the Asian district. It's my district. Just kidding. Oh, spicy Hunan. His district. <laughs> go, go, go. Have some videos. What is this called? Sour Sour Guanabana. Guanabana. Da, 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 da. Guanabana. What? Finger Madeline. You want a finger Madeline? I do want a finger Madeline. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye, Gary. Bye. <laughs> All right, we are at the airport going home. From, uh, this was basically a business trip that became that came out to be like a vacation <laughs> we enjoyed it this was a great weekend Lala Gary thank you very much for the good memories that you that you guys gave us and I'm not a huge expert about Houston Texas but if you guys have any questions just let me know in the comment section below and and I will try my best to answer it what come on come on no okay Airport, Houston, it was great, we'll be back, and I'm out, bye-bye.